everyone, this is Martha and for today's video, I'm going to show you my makeup collection. It's not as many, it's not as overwhelming as the makeup collection of the other gurus and YouTubers that I've watched um, recently. But I think I did pretty good in collecting my makeup. Um, I bought what I need and what I can use. So let's start the video now and I'll see you guys later. Okay, here's my makeup collection and I also have some over here on my train case and my makeup kits over there. But this one, it's originally here in my bookcase. I took it out just to do this video. I don't have a vanity <laughs> because my um, apartment is too small but I'm actually finding a place for it now because I think I need it but okay um, since I don't have it yet I'm going to show you my makeup collection like this first so here are my makeup brushes and I actually did this their holder I bought a flower vase and a, I don't know a candle holder I think wait let me remove this so it looks like this and then I bought like beads and marbles that's color I don't know pink or purple so I bought that and then I also bought a ribbon and then just tied it around the vase here are the face brushes that I have um, the others are on my makeup kit but um, these are the brushes I don't use a lot that's why it's here I have two big fluffy face brushes and angled brushes foundation brush contour brush yeah okay and then here on the smaller um, makeup holder i have my eye brushes i put it here because i don't do eyeshadow every day it's impossible to do it here in the philippines since it's too hot it will melt in my face so i just use this whenever there's an occasion that i have to go to so yeah Okay, we're done with that. We're gonna go here on the right side where I keep my foundations and BB creams. And then I also have this. It's one of my favorites from e.l.f. Their Poreless Face Primer. Um, having big pores is one of my problems. So I always use um, pore minimizing primers before I put on my BB cream or foundation. And then here I have random... Um, lipsticks here are like the um my revlon color burst bombs and i have the jordanas here they're matte lipsticks and then i have wet and wild i have a ysl which my mom gave me and i have a pack lipstick it's a philippine brand over here i have my two inglot lipsticks and then i just have a random um lip balm over there and then I have three drawers below of that holder. On my first drawer, I have um, my ColourPop, what do you call this? Blush ons. So I have the shade Birthday Suit and oh, Between the Sheets. This is one of my favorites. Between the Sheets from ColourPop. And then I, ha I have the e.l.f. High Definition Under Eye Setting Powder. I will recommend this product, guys, because it really sets your makeup under your eye. Oh, that's a good product. And then I have my MAC highlighter. It's in Hush, but, you know, it faded. And then I have here my e.l.f. bronzer and my NARS Orgasm um, blush on. And I have some minis of Benefit. Sunbeam and stay don't stray eye primer right that's the first layer and then the second layer I have my Inglot lip crayons and then I have the Rockateur um, blush on from Benefit which also doubles as my bronzer or a contour powder so I always bring this whenever I travel because it looks good in pictures and it's multi-purpose as well so there Rockateur from Benefit and this is my tape measure. It's so cute with the tassel. It's hard to film holding the camera in one hand, I tell you. But yeah, here's my um, tape measure. Whenever I need to measure furniture and everything. Alright, and then 
the last drawer are my lashes this one's effed up <laughs> i need to throw this away i usually use uh, my lashes like three times and then just throw it away but there are also good lashes that last like until six times so it depends all right we're done with that and on the center part i have my mac lipsticks i only have nine uh okay i don't actually use all of them right now because i'm into liquid lipsticks but yeah i bought a holder that fits exactly how many mac lipsticks i have and then here i have my favorite mac case ever my mac heatherit face powder and i have a milani blush on here this one I don't use a lot because the smell bothers me. I don't know. Um, I don't know with you guys. If you have this, let me know what you think because there's a, cer a certain smell of this product that um, really bothers me. Okay, let's put that back. All right, I have one, two, three, four, five. I have six layers of liquid lipsticks. So you already know. Oh, not everything is liquid lipsticks. These are lip liner so I have five levels um, so you already know how addicted to them I am right now so here on the first level I have my color pops um, I still have some over there that I haven't unboxed yet so I only have these here I have their um, lipsticks I have the color Lumiere, Lumiere by Kathleen lights one of my favorite youtubers and I also have like a the brave brink yeah brink color I love nude lipsticks I'm not into dark red or bright pink I'm more into mauvey and pinkish and brownish and then here I have Scrooge and then this is teeny tiny and then I have Lumiere too and then a little um Times Square over there and here on the second layer I have my LA splash and my dose liquid lipsticks my favorite is stone from dose and seductress from la splash so there and then on the third drawer i have my milani amores i have loved and what's this ooh, ooh. can't see fling i have the color loved and fling and then i have two lime crimes the other one is red velvet and faded and then i have one jordana sweet cream mat and it's a gift from my cousin francel who's gonna make her youtube channel soon so watch out for her guys this is on the shade rose macaroon yep all right let's move on to the fourth these are my nyx's nyx suede and the nyx soft matte lip cream I have the shade um, Soft Spoken. This is a good um, NYX Soft Spoken, guys. It's a good brownish nude liquid lipstick. I will recommend this. It's cheap and it's so, 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 so nice on the lips. And then I have a dark red here. And the shade is Vintage Retro. Right, and then of course I have the classics. I have Prague, which is they said that um, it's a dupe for Kylie Jenner's Posy K. And then I have a dark red soft matte lip cream in Budapest. All right, and then I have a fairly nude pinkish color of cans. There you go. And then on the fifth level, I have my um, lip glosses. Because sometimes I just want my lips to look shiny and kissable. <laughs> so on top of the lipstick or um, liquid lipstick, I put my lip gloss. And then I have my Wet n Wild liquid lipstick. I don't know. Um, I'm 50-50 on this. The color is amazing, but then it chaps after a while. It actually crumbles on my lip. I don't know for, for the others, but for me, it cracks. Okay, and I have two Anastasias. I have milkshake and the other one is crafty. I love them both. All right, let's put it back. And then here on the last level, 
<laughs> I have my Nexus and I have my um, Colourpop lip liners. I have what's this? Jordana lip liner. Yeah, so I have those. I'm addicted to lip liner because sometimes I don't really need to apply lipstick anymore or lip uh, liquid lipstick anymore. I just put on my lip liner and I'm good to go. Okay, my Mac. Um, lip liners doesn't fit this storage so I just put them here with my Inglots but a lot of my MAC lip liners are on my um, whoo, makeup kit because I use them all the time and here I have my palette um, here is my Stila palette it's called red carpet Lux because as you can see the eyeshadow colors are amazing I love using this whenever I do smoky eye because the dark color is not black but it's the right amount of dark I don't know if you can see it so I don't know if the shade is in the back oh it is the shades are shell puck dahlia and fade is a cheek color so uh, you have three eyeshadows and you have one blush so Stila I think they don't have this anymore. It's an old palette that they sell. Um, and I can't let go of it. Because it's this good. And then I have my uh, two MAC palettes. It's actually three before. But I gave one palette to my mom. Because she likes putting on makeup. And I don't put on eye makeup every day. Like she does. So yeah. It's with her right now. This one. Okay. Oh my god, one is missing. Where is it? Oh no. Okay, anyway, these are all MAC eyeshadows. Yep. And I'm really, 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 really addicted to the color purple and pink before when I bought them. So obviously, I have all of these. One of my favorites here is the Stars and Rockets. I think it's this one. It's really good for a bright look on your eye and then um, I also have cranberry here cranberry yeah and it's also my favorite but yeah if you look at it it looks like it's never been used because I don't really use them that often I don't know if I wasted my money on it but it's good to look at and I'm frustrated because I'm, I'm losing this one I don't know where I put it so yeah okay that's the first palette and then this is the second one it's not full it's my uh, nude palette so yeah it's all neutral colors i use vanilla for my um this is the vanilla eyeshadow it's white and it's lightly matte with little glitters i don't know yeah i use this for my um tear duct and sometimes I use it for my um, brow bone but um, yeah so that's that all right and then I have my contour palette here from LA colors I bought this for only eight dollars at Ross when I was in the States a few months ago and I'm in love with this palette because it doesn't disappoint it's very cheap but um, the range of the colors of the contour powders are nice. They have the dark and then medium and then the light one. And then the highlighters are also nice. And now we're going to move on to my makeup kits and my train case. I think I'm just going to start with a train case because it's not a lot. I mean, I use this for storage only because I have some um, items or makeup that I haven't used yet. And I just want to store them here in some of the boxes like this one are empty boxes of my liquid lipsticks and i don't know why i can't let them go so there you can see a lot more and then here i have a ben nye i don't know banana powder um case that i've used up because i have a big one now and then i have a spare baby skin um primer from maybelline and on this side I have some random eye stuff that I don't use a lot or are still new 
I have um, eyeliners and then I have eyebrow pencil and then I have my NYX white eyeliner and then my e.l.f. mineral eyeshadow primer all right and then over here I have my um, scoogies and then inside are a lot of unused and still unopened things I have my blistex lip balm and then uh, I don't know the nozzle of my blow dryer and then I have my unused um the falsies okay and then I have my elf high definition powder there and then I have an elf kabuki brush I have more eyelashes more eyelashes um, and then I have a stock of my favorite concealer the Maybelline H wind in light and then I also have my MAC face powder here that I haven't opened yet. So that's that for my train case. I used to put all my makeup here before. Alright, so let's close that. Close it, close it, close it. Boom. Alright, and then here's my makeup kit. Um, I always bring them whenever I go overnight or um, I travel because it's very, very handy and um, everything I need to put on makeup is inside so my daily look everything is inside the things that I need to achieve that look okay so let's start with this big thing let me open it shung, shung, shung. wait a moment okay this is like a book type kind of oops it's upside down it's a book type kind of makeup kit or makeup bag it's from Sonia Kashuk. I got it from Target for $24. 24 or 18 I forgot. But, um, so I love this kit because you can put your brushes here. There's a brush holder, guys. So these are my brushes that I use every day. And um, they stay permanently in this um, storage because, you know, whenever there's like a... And on the spot overnight or whatever I just grab this bag and I'm okay because everything's in here okay on this side I have my um, foundation concealer and my bronzers contour powder blush ons and primer over there and then of course the brushes and then on the other side I have um, a highlighter an extra concealer I have my um, pins over there whenever I want to fix my hair and I have a kabuki brush whenever I put um, glitter on my um, legs or my body and then I have this princess little pouch where I put my beauty blender so it won't get dirty and get mixed up with all the things that's inside here okay so that's that and if you're wondering why I don't have lipsticks over there is because it's in this baby right here. It's the NYX professional um, makeup thingy that I got from seven years ago that I never actually used ever until I saw this two months ago somewhere here in my room and then I said, oh, why not? So it came in very handy because I need something like this. Guys, look at it. You can open it. I think this is a brush holder, this part. But a lot of my brushes don't fit anyway because it's too tall, especially the MAC brushes. So I just put my lip liners in here. I have my MAC lip liners here. I have, I think, Sore Spice, Heroin, and everything in there. And then I have my contour brush here for the nose. And then I also have here my LA Pro concealer and then I have my things for my brows and my eyeliners here and on this side um, this is where I put my um, brow gel and a random lip balm and I don't know what this uh, mascara yeah brow cara and on this side um, this is where I put my um, brow gel and a random lip balm and I don't know what this uh, mascara yeah brow cara and inside is where I put my lipsticks whenever I go everything is on the storage right now right there so um, there's nothing here but my lip primers from Colourpop but yeah 
So usually I bring four to five shades of lipsticks whenever I travel, depends on what I wear and you know, just to have an extra. So yeah, that's that for my makeup kits. So we're done with my train case, makeup kits and my um, little thingy, vanity thingy over there. And now let's proceed over here. Um, this is um, a drawer here in my um, closet where I just keep like everyday stuff as well. When I don't want to put foundation and I just want to have a simple makeup and something I can grab really quick because you know when you get your makeup kit it's gonna take time and everything so I keep here a MAC face powder for on the go and then I have here an eyeliner a brow pencil and then I have a BB cream or a tint fluid foundation I have a bronzer and then I have a blush palette here and then the Maybelline primer and then I have my um, oils rose hip oil and canola oil canola I mean castor oil hell canola and then I have here um, a tone correcting powder from elf and then this one an eyebrow kit from from elf so yeah that's it and the great part about this guys is that it's right below my mirror so you know it's very very easy to grab so that's it you guys, we're done with this makeup collection video and thank you so much for watching. I hope you liked it and um, what else should I say? Yeah, just follow me on my social media accounts and let's get social, let's be friends. Um, it's popping on the screen right now and it's also in the link down below. Thank you so much for watching guys, good night and God bless you all. Yes, I'm wearing a duster because it's really it's too hot here in the Philippines and I don't know, it makes me feel comfortable. So, yeah.